of the destroyed. In any city, in any country, go to any mental institution or halfway house you can get yourself to. Walk to the front desk and address the worker there, asking to see the holder of the destroyed. Should the worker cry out in horror, then you've come at a bad time. Or possibly a good time. Death by spontaneous combustion isn't all that bad. If the worker laughs, you've come to the right place at the right time. The floor will crack, then break entirely, as if it was made of glass. When you hit the ground below, walk straight ahead until you see a small flame. Keep walking forward until you can see what feeds the flame. Bend down and ask the now very burnt thing that was once a man, what happened to the ones that were destroyed? The arm of the thing will reach out and grab your neck as the holder begins to tell you the tales of every seeker that was destroyed in his quest and of the objects that were destroyed. When he is finished telling his stories, his arm will burst into flame once more. Ignore it. It won't burn you. If it does burn, then don't worry, for you will be dead soon, even if you do let go. Quickly, however, as the world begins to burn away, grab the arm and close your eyes. As the world burns, you will feel the part of the arm you grabbed begin to change into another object. You will wake up wherever you call home. The matches in the book you now hold burn with a special flame. Whatever their fire touches will be repaired if it is broken and destroyed if it is whole. Be warned, however, that if you attempt to use it on another human, your flesh will burn instead. The matchbook is object 194 of 538. Keep it after all the matches are gone, lest his flame turn on you.